Hi, I'm Kyle. And I'm Carly. Today we're going to be talking about a sea snail named Garrett. Ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain! I can't hear you! Aye, aye, Captain! Oh! Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? That's right, Gary does. And Gary's in danger because of the ocean acidification. Let's start off by defining ocean acidification. Ocean acidification is the ongoing decrease in the pH of the Earth's oceans caused by the uptake of carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. Acidification can have some nasty effects on organisms like Gary, but let's start from the beginning about sea snails, where they come from, what they're like before the terror. Sea snails tend to live in seawater off of coastal areas and other shallow waters, such as coral reefs or the rocky shores. Most sea snails are omnivores that like to eat bark and algae. Other sea snails, however, can be carnivores that like to eat a variety of other sea organisms, such as sea worms, other snails, and sometimes starfish. Sea snails play a very important role in the ocean's food chain. However, because of ocean acidification, their population has been decreasing. Ocean acidification dissolves snail shells. If you look to the left, that is a normal sea snail shell. The right is a shell that has gone through acidification. As you can see on the shell on the right, there are now holes and other chunks taken out of it from the carbon dioxide eating away the shell. The snail loses its shell, not only does it lose its protection, but it also loses energy that is necessary for other things in the snail's life, such as hunting for food. Without having the energy to hunt for food, the snail could die of starvation. Snails move around by using their foot, which is a muscular organ that lines the bottom of the body of the snail. Also, snail have teeth. They are ribbon-looking organs. They cannot chew food, but they can grind and tear it. Sea snails are a necessity in ocean life, and they're also a necessity to humans. We need to save them. We can do this by reducing ocean acidification, which we can reach by reducing our production of carbon dioxide. So please help us save Gary. It's so sad. Look at your <laughs> sad faces. Help us. We must begin now before it's too late.